going to get rid of the um, area that I don't need and quickly jump to that section. Um, you can see there is a lot of browsing through going to the end and coming back. There's a lot of back and forth just to make sure that you're not missing anything. You are keeping the interesting parts and uh, you are not um, showing any repeats, basically avoiding repetition. That's what you want to focus on. And you want to show some interesting angles and that's what you want to show. And um, that's basically all there is to it. Uh, all you need to put something very dynamic and interesting together is music. Music is very important. I cannot emphasize enough that how important your music is. Your selection of music, the mood of the music, um, for the kind of the ambience that you're showing, the, it has to be a match. So uh, please, please, uh, my advice to you is that spend a lot of time browsing for music, uh, for the right music, and um, take your time, be patient, and choose something that goes with your footage. You don't want to put something that is totally irrelevant to what the uh, viewer is watching. Uh, the other most important thing is the sound effects. You don't want to be content to just the music. In addition to the music that you choose for your footage, you really need to add sound effects to various sections and um, give the uh, the work that you've done um, a little more effect and make it dynamic and interesting and to make it stand out. Um, now I'm going to cut this, um, I've cut this section here and I'm looking for another area to cut. I'm going to close this together. I think I'm going to choose this section here. So let's cut this here. Let's stitch this up. Take a look at it. It looks okay. So what I'm going to do is to let this turn until I can see a little bit of the lens. Then I'm going to stop it and jump to a different angle and ramp it up. So I'll show you what I mean. So I'm going to cut it here and I want to show this angle here. And I just don't want to go through the whole section. So I'm going to, the section that I don't use, I'm going to speed it up to 10,000. And um, let's see what it looks like. Okay. That's okay. And I'm going to stop it here. Actually, let's go back a little bit here. Okay. I'm going to cut it here. And um, I think that's pretty much it. Uh, I'm going to speed that up to 10,000 as well and make a sharp turn to the other side of the rig. Yep. And that's where I'm going to cut it. I think I'm going to cut it here. Yeah, here's good. I think I'm going to cut it here. Bring it closer a little bit.
that's good. Okay. Right, now we're getting closer to the one minute timeline that uh, we initially intended. Now we're on one minute, 30 seconds. But don't forget that we do have a logo to add to it as well. So you want it to be really less than one minute to allow that little bit of section for your logo. Now I'm going to speed this section up a little bit. It's too small, too slow. The next section as well, I'm going to see if we need to speed this up a little bit or even cut it. Yeah, I'm going to speed that up to 150. Close that up. That's too long. I'm going to cut that, close it up. Okay. That's it. I'm going to cut that. I think. Let's see. Yeah. I'm going to get rid of the transition. I don't need the transition there. So I'm going to cut it here and this section here I don't need. So let's close it up and that's it. That looks good. That is a little bit longer than I want. So I'm going to cut that. Okay. Keep this section here. Here I'm using um, Edelchrome slider. So, uh, just very smoothly moving from right to left or left to right. And um, here, I think I'm going to start from here. So, I'm just going to cut this section that I don't need and let it run. That looks better. That looks good jump into the dead cat microphone and after that jumps back to the front of the camera and slowly turning again stop maybe start from here to Okay, that looks good. So I'm going to keep this here. That looks good. Cut it here. I think instead of letting it turn, I'm just going to speed it up a little bit to 5,000 this time because of the shortness of the clip, the footage. So it can jump to the other section of the camera okay and it's getting down to just under the one minute so that's exactly where we want it and um, i'm happy with this now so i'm going to do a little bit of color grading and um, actually before doing that Let's see. Um, no. We just do a final check to make sure that everything is okay. Um, right, so we're going to do a little bit of color grading. So I'm just going to create an adjustment layer and drag it. 